The turban is called a Dastar Bunga in Punjabi, which means Sikh fortress turban or towering turban. It's made up of 37 meters of cloth, six quoits, a tier of crescents, two double-edged swords, a dagger, a crescent, a badge, and a wrapping cord. The main purpose of this turban would be to serve as an intimidation tactic for the enemy on the battlefield. It was also a place to store weapons and protect the head from sword blows. The Sikh warrior tradition came about due to religious persecution by the then opposing Mughal Empire. The British were sufficiently impressed with the Sikhs and their fighting skills and therefore they enlisted Sikh soldiers within their regiments. We are not sure how the turban came to the British Museum, however we are aware that the turban was donated to the Banqueting House Museum by a Lieutenant Colonel of the British Army in 1896. An active decision was made to replace the fabric as the original fabric was self-combusting. Um, as in Sikh tradition, turbans are replaced over time. However, the original weapons were used on the new fabric. It's important to understand that the turban is very much a living and continuing tradition and not just a practice of the past. Although this turban looks very different to the one that Sikhs wear today, it still stands for the same thing. It represents faith and identity of the Sikhs.